Yeah, Jesse Matt. Jordan and then someone else. No, no, no. Oh, it's Jesse Matt. Oh. It's all right. This is the semifinals. So we're all good. Uh, yes, he is not. Uh, he's under KDP, I think. Yep, KDP. And he's going Luigi? Uh, no. Uh, I guess so. He's going Luigi. We've had two people going Luigi today, it seems. Yeah, Nick Best has a, has a really good Luigi. I'm not sure exactly how uh, Attila's or uh, KDP's uh, Luigi fares out. Right you uh, updated the wrong screen. One, two, three, four. No, because... Okay, well, I don't know why I didn't update then. Just update the other one. Okay. Uh, hey, you, oh, you can leave that as Attila. Or no, that has to switch to Croy. Never mind. It goes Croy, Zilla. All right, so, back to commentary. Um, this stock is almost over for both players. Uh, Wario at 133%, the Luigi Attila, uh, 86. There's a neutral air that will do the trick, folks. All right, there we go. Perfect. Already gone for Wario, actually. Yep. Yeah. Uh, yeah. It was a uh, it was a neutral air at around 120. It was a uh, it was a good kill. Two characters who have a uh, very strong short hop aerial game. Yeah, uh, you can oh, already tell. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, Crow, <laughs> Crow the Wario with the uh, neutral airs and up airs especially. Uh, as well as back air. That's a decent move. Uh, he also likes his down air because the corkscrew is very high priority. Uh, ranges above Olimar's up smash. Oh my. Okay, there's another grab. Good back throw there. Seems like a very strong throw. Uh, it is. It is. Um, it can't kill because it it hits them or it throws them right towards the corner. That's the problem. Uh, um, it's sense. a gr it's a great throw if it had a more horizontal uh, launch, but it doesn't, unfortunately. Neutral air though is really where he steps his game up. That neutral air uh, goes through many up smashes, uh, yeah, many counter I've, moves. I've, I've seen it enough in both in all games, really. Yeah. Ooh. That's an angled up forward smash, just the tips of the fingers, and he, c he takes it there. Gets a balloon, too. Yeah, <laughs> a victory is assured. Side B, Almost no. Almost the fart off the ledge. So it was back to even. Yeah, back to e Ooh, eats the jab to F smash. If the other two, two stocks follow suit, then it's Luigi's game, really. Yeah, we'll absolutely. I mean, right right now we're it, it's 56 to 22, 34. So it's it's still relatively close. I wouldn't call I wouldn't c count either of these yeah, players out. I wouldn't either. They're both uh, very good players. And both have a very good recovery. Both characters. Uh, Ooh, Jabba B does the trick to take the stock. Uh, that's that was like just a kill. That was very nice. Game do back on Smashville. All right, salty run back, I guess. Felt like he could have done something he didn't. Yeah, Croy is uh, Croy's one of the stronger players, and to be honest, Jesse's uh, Jesse's Luigi in my uh, in my experience does does not outweigh uh, Croy's Wario. Hmm. I know I know for a fact that Croy's Wario is very good with those uh, falling neutral airs and just just the fact that Wario has so much horizontal movement in the air. Yeah, I see that. Might it just be the difference of playstyles between uh, Attila and Colin? Uh, yeah. He might be trying to fight another Luigi. <laughs> that's true. That's one, true. When this one's out on the field. That is very true. Uh, either Colin or uh, Nick Best is known for his uh, Luigi secondary. Yes. He might be mixed up in the styles and. Yeah, exactly. Not well, able to cover something. There's his bike to jump. Nice He's recovery. He's doing better this game already. So. Yep. Absolutely. Trades with the Nair. He's going to jump down B now. Oh. Nope. 
did not have enough time after that second one. Good, good power shield in the first frame there. Good Nair. <laughs> yeah. There's a lot of those. Yeah, the Nair is not a very strong move, but it just it just kind of inconveniences the it's other player. Fast and huge, basically. Yes, exactly. And the fact that uh, not only is it big, it's equal equal strength on both sides. Uh, as well as that is uh, Wario has a lot of horizontal air movement, as I was saying, so he can cover a lot of ground, and if he misses, he can just safely back away. <laughs> Good read on that spot dodge. It was very nice. He doesn't kill. It was a fully charged one. And he drops down for a footstool as well. well Finishes that stock right off. Whatever works, right? He's done really well adapting so far. Absolutely. I think this is what Croy wanted to be like. From the get-go. Seems like it just was the different Luigi problem. Now that, he, now that he's got a little read on him. Yeah, exactly. A lot just takes him a little bit to get used to it. Good good power shield there. That would definitely would have finished him off. He's putting these attacks out just outside of Luigi's range. Yep. Saying, if you try to get me, you're going to get hit. Yeah. Not only that, he's just kind of dancing around the edge of Luigi's range, coming in, then quickly floating out again with that horizontal movement. I imagine by now he probably has second or third stage waft. Not the full one yet, though. Uh, it's getting close. It's getting close now. I can see it. Or I can see him using it around now. Off. Yep, there it is. It is yep. That was, that was very good. That was very good. Uh, well played. Three stock. Very good option off the around the ledge against Luigi, it seems. Yes, yeah. Uh, Luigi's very limited in his recovery options. He can uh, down B or up B. Uh, side B is only good from far away. And I guess the waft be, would be both, then, wouldn't it? Yep, absolutely. Everybody. Trying to read the roll with the bite. Doesn't quite happen, though. Oh, there's, Reads there's... The get up, though. Yep. Trades with the forward air. Oh, that was a quick grab. I really thought Luigi was going to get that grab there. So here comes a side B. Misfire to the stage. Gets a good grab up to... Or up air. Forward smashes. Yeah, that, uh, that forward smash, when it gets angled up, it has a lot of kill power. And Corey's using his for the armor of it, isn't he? Yeah, yeah. Uh, not only that, it's a very strong move. Uh, puts him forward a little bit, but yes, the super armor on Corey's F smash is, is very nice. Is very good. Oh, good double up air, but he trades with the Nair. Oh. That, that's all good for him at this point. Really. Oh, yes, absolutely. When you're up a stock, you can He's afford spinning. to trade. Oh, <laughs> playing the catch with some tires. I've heard that Wario with the tire in his hand is extremely dangerous. Uh, he is, because what he can do is not only is he really good at... Uh, oh, shoot. That's the move. Glide toss? Thank you. Glide tossing, yes. Uh, not only that, but he can hit you and then just reset into another move. Although Luigi's back here, there, just canceled out. Oh. Gets a little greedy with that. That's a burn. That was a burn at 6 minutes 12, and it takes a minute 20 to fully charge, I do believe. So we'll see it up again at uh, 4.52. We'll see him try to, try to use it in about 45 seconds or so. Yeah, yeah. But if he doesn't get a chance, he'll save it for the full one. Yep. Oh. Run just on forward there. Whatever works for you, I suppose. Can't get back soon enough to punish the up B. Yep. So right, much shield yeah, right there on the ledge, uh, when Croy used his Nair off Luigi's shield, what he tried to do was he tried to do a short hop Nair, and he hit him with the startup frames of the Nair, but then he backs away out of range, and then is able to come back as the Nair ends. Oh. So, he, yeah, he hits him as he jumps, and then as he's landing again, just so we can ensure, like, ultimate safety when he's using the move. Huh. Cool. Power shield's a down air into a grab. That up air looks like it hurts so, so much. The up air? Yeah. Oh, yeah. That up air is... A lot of freeze frames on that thing. Yeah. It's really brutal. Oh, back air there. Hoot. B. Oh. Mario's up. <laughs> kind of places him back on stage. Luigi with that... Uh, kill? No. 
Safe forward smash. Didn't kill though. Yep, there it is. Good set. Good set from Croy. Good show on both players. Uh, it was well played. Oh, wait, is this a... Oh, this must be a finals. This must be a finals. We're going to game three, I guess. It didn't until you grabbed it. So game <clears throat> three on Battlefield. Yeah. I think. <laughs> Corey seems to be doing a lot more up airs than before, so. Yeah, he's, he's using his horizontal movement a lot right there. You see him using up air, in and back, and the neutral air, in and back, forward air, in and back. The back and forth, even with air dodges, is really hard to see and punish. Oh, absolutely. It's really hard to read exactly where he's going to be when you want him to be at a certain spot. Okay, that's an SD. An SD. At least that's his opponent is around kill percents. Yeah, that's... Oh, very true. Very true. Oh. That was an interesting little combo there. Good damage. Yeah. Just something to rack it up. Slides all the way off. <laughs> yeah. That tends to happen with Luigi. Against Wario, uh... Oof. I really thought he would grab him there. Hmm. Huh. Oh, well. Baits the Nair. Gets a hit. That's one big thing about playing against Luigi. Yeah. They're very, like, aggressive with their narrow set of combos. Yeah, yeah. You yeah. can easily abuse that for responses. Absolutely. And, I mean, Nair, Nair is what's called a sex kick, so it does get uh, it does get weaker as time goes on. Start yeah. strong, f finish slow. <laughs> but uh, it's really good for setting up into another neutral air. I mean, I've seen people short hop uh, neutral air and then using lo how floaty Luigi is, Float down at the very end of it. Just tap them up. Short hop Nair to reset, and then it just it just kills them. It's an interesting character. Oh yeah, that, that was rough. Good edge hop. That was a very good read. Now, where, where is Luigi on the tier list? Like uh, or I think he's more towards B tier. I could be wrong, but um, the reason he's so good and bad is. Um, his physics, really. Yeah, his the fact that he slides so much is just... It helps him, but then it doesn't. Because as you've seen, uh, Croy will have to smash him when he's in shield. He slides off stage. But what you can do Gets is... Get him away from pressure, but at the same time... Yeah, it, it, it kind of... Exactly. Uh, trying to go for the suicide kill, I guess? With the bite? Does that work in this game? What's that say? You're getting a bite off stage. Will that be a suicide kill? or? It will be, but it's pretty easy to mash out. Okay. Uh, even at high percent, you can mash out fairly quickly. That, so it, that will be the set.